Hello there, everybody. Little Quinzel. Harley Quinn. It's one of my daughter's toys. Thought I'd come up here and stand in her room today. Just kind of look around. So the whole point of this video and the reason why I'm doing it live is because I think it would be, it's going to be easier to say it live than to just record it. But today, my little girl is on her way to a courthouse where she is going to testify against the man who molested and raped her. And so I thought I'd come up here and I'd stand in her room because she just recently got with us. Um, and just look at all the innocent things. Uh, look at all the toys, the teddy bears. And to remind myself that that's my little girl and she is so strong. I can't imagine the courage and guts it would take to go before a jury and testify at 10 years old when somebody hurts you like that. That's strength. That's real strength. And that's why this video is, today my 10 year old becomes a hero. Because what she's doing is really, really heroic. I almost feel like I need these stuffed animals more than she does, you know? <laughs> right? It's hard to look at everybody in the camera, so if I keep looking away, I apologize. I want everyone to remember that the world is made of love and peace. It might have become hate and war. It might be, have become other things, but inevitably it was made of love and peace. And if anybody runs across this video anywhere in any timeline, remember that innocence is very important, whether it comes to a relationship whether it comes to life, whether it comes to toys, people, their innocence is very important. And what somebody tried to do to my daughter was shatter her innocence. He tried to take her innocence away from her. To all you men out there who are going through and have gone through the same thing I am, remember that it's not their fault. And that what happened to them does not make you love them any less. And remind them every day of how proud you are of them. Tell them that it doesn't make them weak. It just makes them stronger. It makes them above and beyond other people. This is the point of this video. This is the message. That if a 10 year old can step up and become a hero. I wonder how many other people out there can step up and face your fears and become a hero just like her. If anybody in the world is experiencing domestic violence or molestation or rape, I want you to get a hold of someone. I want you to stand up and I want you to talk. I want you to take your truth and tell it because the truth inevitably will set you free. There's plenty of hotlines and places on the internet that you can call or get a hold of a friend, but don't feel like you need to hide. Don't feel like you need to keep it from somebody because you don't. And there are people in the world that will help you and they will step up and they will speak for you. Today, my little girl became a hero and I've never been more proud of her.